Hey everybody, welcome to another Age of Grogu and I've got another unboxing from the Sideshow line of uh, the Clone Wars pieces. Uh, they developed this piece of Yoda um, and at one point I was like, no, I'm not going to bother getting it. Uh, and then it went onto a waiting list and I was like, oh man, I missed out kind of thing. And then suddenly I decided I'm going to be doing this big Clone Wars uh, display set up with all the 12 inch figures. And I thought, man, what a great place to actually put a Yoda in the middle of a battlefield on my new display I'm going to be designing over the next several months. I really wish I, uh, I you know, hadn't missed out. Anyway, for some strange reason and luck, uh, a lot of work came through this past month and suddenly I've got, you know, that little bit of excess and out of the blue, they took the Yoda off of the waiting list and it was right there. And I was like, oh my God, this is amazing. So I ended up by uh, placing the order, picked it up uh, and, and managed to get myself uh, uh, Yoda, a uh, 12 inch uh, uh, scale. So let's check this guy out. Uh, this is different from the uh, standard uh, uh, toys. This is obviously, it's Sideshow, not Hot Toys directly. Uh, but Sideshow do, do some nice stuff. Um, uh, and, you know, I haven't picked up as many of them, but when they do, they do some some very cool things. Uh, this related case, they did a Clone Wars line. And uh, not many of them, but enough to be like, okay, they're not too bad. Anyway, let's check out this Yoda. Oh, look at this. Okay, I'm going to, before I do that, I'm going to take off the wrapper. Um, so... Let's take that off. Okay, so checking this out. Nice box. Very different, uh, different style from the uh, from the uh, standard uh, uh, stuff, uh, but it's very Clone Wars oriented in the look and design. Uh, looks great. And then on the back here, you've actually got an image there of Yoda itself. Uh, it's actually not not a bad little box. I mean, you know, compared to compared to the fact they could have made a big thing, but it's like, no, this is actually kind of cool. It's, it's actually works perfectly for you. Let's check out this guy right now. Oh, this is cool. Okay, so inside the box, you've got a Star Wars uh, kind of uh, piece across there, a strap that uh, holds it all together. That's that's pretty sweet. Oh, this whole thing comes out as one piece. It's almost like a little carry piece. That's sweet, okay. And then it slides off. Be careful, I don't want to damage this. It's like I'm always really careful with these, try to avoid accidentally breaking something. In this case, I don't want to damage the strap. This is kind of a nice little little strap that they put on there. It's very tight, but it looks cool. That's that, that's pretty cool. I like that. Okay, so Yoda. Looks like we've got okay, so let's start with the back piece here. We've got all these additional hands that go with him. We've got a solid base plate. I'm probably not going to use the base itself. Um, although it looks like he could be mid-flight with that. Hang on a second. Oh no, okay, maybe not. I think that's designed just as a solid base, but it's got the Star Wars brand underneath there, which is cool. And then here has got several different hands that we happen to have here. Different types, different angles, different positions. Six different hands in total. In fact, you can see them right there. Very cool. Okay, so we go to the next stage here. Pulling out Yoda himself. Okay, so he's protected in plastic. We're going to take off the plastic around his body. And this, this really is cool. Like... I have to say, this is the closest piece to the actual Clone Wars that you could possibly get in the animated show kind of version. And I know they changed the form and the look and the style, but I really, really like this Yoda. Um, I, I love the way he was animated. I love the style of animation. Uh, some people think he looks a little creepy. I, I personally think he looks absolutely adorable. Um, and, you know, it'd be nice to get a realistic Yoda, but this Clone Wars one for my Clone Wars display is absolutely what I am glad I was actually lucky enough to get my hands on. 
We also have in here a couple of different feet variations, which is interesting. This one looks like they're they're kind of in in kind of claw mode, as if he's like whole, you know, like he could be on somebody's shoulders or something leaping in midair. This actually might be what I might be changing his feet to, by the way, because I might be doing a leaping in midair. We have his uh, staff, which is a little walking stick, which is really cool. And then we have what I want to be using is and putting on is his little lightsaber. And again, uh, really cool detail. Okay, I need the hand that holds the lightsaber. All right, how am I going to do this? He wants to be holding his right hand. Let's see what we got. Right-handed lightsaber right here. I'm going to pluck that in there. It's, it's a little tight around there, which is good. It holds the grip. I'm going to switch out his hand and they just pop straight off. Look, they pop straight off. I want to be careful here. Okay, that comes off there. Let's go in here. So, Yoda and his lightsaber. This is going to be really cool to put in the collection. I'm, I'm really happy with this purchase. Uh, nice job, Sideshow. I am glad that you did do a line of the Clone Wars, even though I did not pick up some of the ones like Anakin and Obi-Wan, I've been getting the more realistic versions of the Clone Wars Anakin and have on pre-order the realistic uh, Obi-Wan, though they're, they're actually from Hot Toys. Um, but at the same time, this Yoda is going to be amazing to have in this display. I can't wait uh, to be able to start building the display I'm talking about. I'm going to be building it as part of the Battle of Christopsis, and even though Yoda was there for a very short time, I'm actually going to put him and all the other clone troopers and, and the bark speeder and, and, and everything else I've got there, Anakin on the staff, they're all going to be part of this display, which is going to be kind of a fun piece to, uh, to put together. Anyway, thank you for joining me for an unboxing and I shall see you on the next one. A disturbance in the Force, there is. Master Yoda of the Jedi Council, this is...